Hey guys, uh, pretty much finished up with the with the wheel horse. Um, have some issues uh, that I need to try to figure out. Um, the hood. I bought brand new housing for the for the hood for the headlights, and um, man, this hood was so bent up and beat up. I tried to straighten it out and stuff, and it just it's just not working. I damn it! I scratched up some of the paint. I just painted the this part, this you know grill part here. Um, going to have to repaint that. Now this housing didn't fit in too bad, but still there's. So I'm gonna order a new set of the the housing. Some of you wheel horse guys, I'm sure, uh, give me some pointers maybe of what I'm doing wrong. Um, uh, I'm sure maybe you guys have ran this problem in the past, but just it just, it just seems like um, evidently I didn't put them in right. Uh, they cracked right here and everything, but. I might have to sand some of the hood. There's some wrinkles in the paint. Uh, this is definitely not show quality. The main purpose was this tractor to make it functional and go through it, make sure everything worked. The electric PTO didn't work. Uh, the wiring was horrible. So now I went through and rewired the entire tractor. Um, installed a new voltage regulator. Did all the wiring. This will all clean up. I need to clean this up and tie it up a little bit so it's a little bit neater than what it is but I rewired the whole tractor to where uh, the electric PTO works the headlights works everything works on it as it should um, it's just some of the the paint didn't turn out like I wanted to there's like ripples and stuff in the paint which you know like I said it'd be different it was a show tractor you know which this is not um, but it how I look at it, it's a hell of a lot better than it was and it looks better so but my plans is to get a mowing deck for it and make it a mowing mower I was going to get um, decals reproduced um, I don't think I'm going to do that uh, there's some on eBay that I've seen I'll probably just get some ones that are uh, a little bit more custom uh, with a wheel horse sign and everything like that and uh, I think I'm just going to throw those on the hood other than that the tractor's pretty much done uh, I need to touch up do some touch up and then I'm going to sand down some places where uh, I'm just not real happy with but I'm going to stop at this point with it and then when it warms up I'm going to do the front tires um, I just you know um, I do have a heater for my garage and it does heat up the garage pretty good so I can paint but I've done a lot of painting over the last couple weeks and drive my wife nuts and you know, I got other stuff in here getting over spray on. So what I'm gonna do is clean out the garage and and um, get everything uh, clean it up a little bit from the overspray and stuff like that. And you know, it warms up a little bit. I can paint outside more. Um, so I'm pretty much done with the with this painting on this tractor because 99% of it's done at this point. So, but um, you know, it turns out everything works good. Uh, she runs good, uh, no problems. Um, I just got to get a seat at this point, and I'll be happy. And then I'll go get some decals, like I said, down the road. I'm going to do a little bit more uh, sanding, wet sanding, and body work on it, and then I'll, then I'll be done. But, you know, this is my first actual, uh, really, like a restore on a tractor I've done where I've tore it completely down to the frame and, and done it. And it's, But um, I still have a little bit. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do about this. I'm going to have to sand it back down again try to smooth it out a little bit I don't know if that's gonna work or not but um, anyways the tractor looks good it runs good and uh, it'll be a good mowing tractor something I can use so figured give you guys get a good look at it doesn't look too bad actually turned out uh, better than I thought it was going to so and like I said I'm not a body shop guy and painting and stuff like that so with the sanding and everything like that it I guess for an amateur, it's okay. He'll do what it's got to do. But like I said, the tractor is a hell of a lot better in the condition it was before, such as the wiring and stuff like that. And uh, the headlights didn't work. The electric PTO didn't work. So, you know, I went in there and rewired everything. Everything works on it now. So now I just need to find good, uh, find me a good motor deck for it. Uh, like I said, there's one down in North Carolina I'll probably end up buying. I'm uh, thinking about driving down there very soon to get it because I can't find another motor deck for this tractor. So... Um, anyways, give you guys a good shot at it, and, um, talk to you guys later.
拜。